Here we are going to talk about um, some of the functions to feed the Poisson regression and negative binomial and some of the survey data analysis counterparts. So for the purposes of illustration, we are just going to use the CCHS data in here. Um, and we can um, create design based on the CCHS data weights that we are given in this particular data set. For the purposes of running the Poisson regression, uh, we still use the GLM function. Remember in the lecture I was talking about Poisson being within the umbrella of GLM. Um, the only difference is that in the family we have to mention it is Poisson, right? And um, we have to use the log link, but uh, when you select the Poisson, that is the default. We can use the sum function from the JTools to extract the coefficients for this um, and similarly you can use another um, portion regression where you are now fitting um, the regression with more covariates and you can again get the coefficients for those uh, using the sum function from the JTOS package. So how do you fit the portion regression for a survey weighted data? Uh, we simply have to use the SVY GLM function from the survey package. Again, you have to specify which is your um, family, and the family is going to be Poisson. And you can again um, get the estimates from here by using the sum function. So, next up, the negative binomial regression. In the negative binomial regression, uh, Again, we are using GLM, uh, but we have to use the negative binomial family and also have to specify the theta parameter. And that will give us the estimates. And in terms of the survey data analysis, you have to use the sbygLM.nb to get the similar type of estimate from uh, negative binomial in a survey design.